like to welcome everybody, first of all, on behalf of Stracker. Um, very thrilled to announce that after two very successful years in P2 with our ARX programme, that as of 2012, Stracker Racing will be stepping up to the World Endurance Championship in LMP1. Uh, the new car, the 03A, is an evolution of the, the car that Highcroft ran at uh, Sebring earlier this year, the 01E. Uh, the big change on this car, it's an all-new monocoque for the car, 2012 regulations. Um, we're expecting quite a, an improvement um, you know, in terms of the aerodynamic performance of the car and, and just general all-round um, tidying up of the package. We, we think it's going to be a, a, a very, uh, very strong package in the gasoline categories. Something that I personally have been looking forward to doing for a while. Uh, if you remember back in 2009, we did the O2A uh, for LMP1. It was really a works car, uh, but we learned a lot of lessons with that car aerodynamically and um, combining that together in, a, in, in something more along the sort of um, uh, s smaller team package, uh, which is the, uh, what the O1 is um, really designed for, uh, which had the coil springs um, suspension and just much more kind of customer orientated. So we're sort of combining the two together to make this new O3A. And uh, it is a good step forward from the car that you saw in Sebring. Uh, the car we saw in Sebring actually wasn't running with all its aerodynamic war paint on. Um, so uh, we're really excited about uh, what we can um, hopefully deliver for uh, Stracker going into next year. We had two fantastic years in P2 and uh, we achieved a lot. We felt that uh, you know, we narrowly missed out on the championship but we're four points behind the championship this year. We had a great Le Mans last year breaking five records and, and a first outright win in Hungary ever in the LMS for a P2 car. So uh, we felt that there's time for new challenges ahead and uh, we've got a strong belief at Stracker that we can uh, get respectable results in P1 in the World Championship. I mean, obviously, we have massive respect for um, you know the likes of Audi and Peugeot uh, that we're going to be racing against. But at the same time, I don't think we're overly frightened by them. Um, we know we've got a, a great team, and if we have a, a good run, I think podium finishes are certainly a possibility. It's going to be very difficult in our first year, but um, you know we don't shy away from the challenge at Straka, and we're uh, really, really up for it. Ultimately, you need your team around you to provide you with a great car. I've got no doubt the car's going to be fantastic to drive in all conditions. Um, but at the same time, I need my two teammates, and uh, it's a team effort at the end of the day. It's a team sport, endurance racing. Um, it's not down to the in individual one person to, to get that result. So, no, like I said before, it's going to take a lot of hard work. There's a lot of challenges ahead, but I think uh, given a lot of testing, get used to the car, we should be in good form.